here we are in the Cuban wilderness. One college student, many trees, water, and many people staring at me vlogging. What will happen next? Find out in man versus college student versus wild. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. We are coming here live from Varadero, Cuba. I'm here with my beautiful girlfriend, Shayna Rosenthal. Say hi. Hi, guys. Lately, we have been staying here in this amazing resort, but today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different. What are we gonna be doing today? We're going on a tour to explore a river. Um, I don't really know too much else. We don't really have too much of a game plan, but we're gonna be doing some really cool stuff. So remember to hit the subscribe button and enjoy the vlog. Woo. Let me give you guys a short introduction to my family that you have probably seen in other videos. Right here we got the two stepbrothers, Roy and Mauricio. We got my dad, the one and only, the guy who buys me all my camera equipment. We got the whole family squatted up in this like mini, what is it, like a minivan, right? A, it's a taxi minivan here in Cuba. Like I said, I got no idea where we are going to be going, but nevertheless, it should be fun. We have just arrived here to this place called La Arboleda and we don't really know what there is so far but I heard there's like a river, we're gonna get food here. So it would be really interesting. What do you guys think? We're in the middle of nowhere! <laughs> we are in the middle of nowhere, I'm not gonna lie. We're really, really far. It's okay, hang in there. This is Shayna's first time in Cuba. What do you think so far? I'm terrified. Do you think you would be like, you know, dead if you stayed here alone for Ab one day? Absolutely, absolutely. So far, all we have is nature and trees and Shayna and Maori criticizing my vlog. I'm not saying anything. Since we're like in the middle of nowhere, but you know, it's like a little like base camp, whatever. I low key feel like Bear Grylls. Here we are in the Cuban wilderness. One college student, many trees, water, and many people staring at me vlogging. What will happen next? Find out in man versus college student versus wild. Look who we got over here, the little world traveler taking a, a classic Instagram picture. Maybe. Not gonna lie, I still have no idea what we are gonna do, but we got some boats here, so maybe that could give us some ideas. But just honestly, just look at the view. It's a pretty dope view. You know, in Miami, you have like a lot of city stuff, so seeing some nature is really amazing. Here we got my dad with the with the Cuban money, as you can see right there. He's about to pay for a water bike. As you can see, my dad is the one who provides my financial life. So thank you, dad. Muchas gracias, papi. Before we go on the water bike, we're having a very, very famous Cuban snack right here. Right there, focus, focus. It's called uh, chicharrón. It's basically fried pork skin. Shayna, I know you don't regularly eat pork, but what do you think about this? Is it good? It's all right. It's solid. It, uh, it's really, really, really crunchy. This is terrible for your health, by the way. Really, really bad for you, but we're really hungry. And when you're in Cuba, why not? Beautiful, we're gonna be eating that food right there later, and it's gonna be great. Hey, you, I'm at the Right now it's time for the water bike. We got Mauricio driving the water bike. We also got Roy as co-pilot of co the water co-pilot of the water bike. We got Shanna right here. We got Bay. Give me my oh, hand. Up, we got the parents on the other water bike right there in back of us. And we got me vlogging the whole experience. We have the co-pilot and the pilot right here. Can you guys explain really fast, how do you drive this mechanism? Well, okay, yes, fiddle. When you go to the left, it goes left. When you go to the right, it goes right. Babe, you know there's crocodiles in the river, right? No, there are. Something that's cool about being in the middle of nowhere is that you have a really cool echo. ECHO! Get 
guess who got promoted to pilot? Co-pilot. Co-pilot. The driving situation now is we got Roy as pilot yep. and we got me as co-pilot. This should go well. The new situation now is that I got promoted to pilot. No, I'm and pilot! And Bay is co-pilot. No. Point is, we got the couple of the year navigating the water bike in the middle of Cuba. After riding on this thing for about like 40, almost an hour now, 40 minutes an hour now, we realize that it is completely broken and that no matter how hard we pedal, it will not go fast. So we're pretty screwed. We're trying to pedal as much as we can right here. The situation is I am pedaling, Shane is pedaling, and then we got Roy steering and Maldives our DJ all the way in the back. And hopefully we will get to land soon enough because we are all very hungry and thirsty. Just to top the whole thing off, it is extremely, extremely hot out here. It's terrible. Guys, we're right there. Right there, we are inside of the dock. So close, last push, last push. Let's go, babe, let's go, babe. Go fast, 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 fast. Come on, come on, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. We're really close, really close. Go fast, go fast, go fast, 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 fast. It's 1.1 mile and we are there. Let's go give it our all, babe. We got this, we got this. We're gonna get food, we're gonna get water. Let's go. Just 20 meters away, 20 meters away. After that exhausting, exhausting water bike ride, we did it, we're good, now I think it's time to eat. Right there, right in back of me, we got what's gonna be my lunch for today. No, nah, no, nah, I'm just kidding. As you guys heard earlier, I'm gonna be eating pork. We're on our way to the restaurant right now, but look how cool this is. Look at this like little river crossing we're gonna have to do right now. You guys notice all the way back there, there's like a little bridge that moves and then there's a string attached to it. And that's how we're gonna get from this side to that side. Here we have the guy who's bringing in the bridge to us that we're later gonna be getting on. So right now we're going on the little bridge to the other side. This is really, really cool, really unique experience that we have never done before. What? Just like that, we made it perfectly safe to the other side. Our restaurant is all the way up here in the top, in the top of the hill is where we're going to be eating our amazing food. Can you explain to us the Cuban appetizers we have going on right now? Here we have some uh, what they call mariquitas, mariquitas. <laughs> aka plantain chips. And then we have avocado, some weird meat stuff, and the disgusting cucumber on the side. Babe, after that water bike session, how hungry are you? Very hungry. So right now we got all the food ready. I got my Cuban pork right there. Let's give it a little bite, just a texture. Mm. 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 That's some good pork. We also got the congri going on right here. Roy, how do you think it's gonna taste? Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> indeed, indeed, bro. We finally got in an amazing Cuban lunch. We're gonna be going back in the taxi minivan on to our next adventure. Our next adventure is visiting a cave. And here we have the cave. We are slowly, slowly entering the cave. Right down there. Right down there is the water where we will be jumping. All right, babe, right now I'm about to jump in the cave. I'm gonna jump in the really cold water. If I don't make it for whatever reason, if I die, if I drown, I love you. You could take care of my camera, take care of my YouTube, take care of everything.
Thank you so much for being my uh, camera woman while I was jumping and doing those amazing tricks. You're very welcome. I wish you would have gone in to be honest, but on the bright side, the water is really, really cold and we know that you're not really the best swimmer out there, so it's good that you didn't go in. How cold was the water? It was so not that cold to be honest. That was fun and cold. Next stop is gonna be the resort. We are back here at the resort, but Roy, Roy, tell me, what do you want? Do you want to challenge me to a game? Ping pong! Roy is about to challenge me to a game of ping pong. He doesn't know what he has coming for him. Who are you? Roy, so how does it feel that I beat you in ping pong? I'm gonna go cry in my room. He's gonna go cry. I destroyed him in ping pong. I am the champion of the resort in ping pong. Woo! Before I end the vlog, I wanted to show you guys the beach because it is one of the main reasons that we come here to Varadero, Cuba every summer. Now I know coming from Miami, we do have a lot of beaches and they are nice, but trust me, no beach is as nice as this one right here. Something that's really, really clutch about this beach. First of all, first of all, look at how blue it is. Just look at that, look at that. It's so nice, so perfect. But then later you're like, you know what? I don't want to be in the water anymore, whatever. It's too hot, you don't like the water, you can't swim, you don't want to drown. Look what you got over here. You got these like little like umbrella thingies, you got the shade, you're covered. You guys see the water? You guys see the beautiful water right there? I'm about to go in the water right now, but I gotta make it epic. Ah, it's been a wild day, I'm about to get in the water. Always remember, stay hydrated. 